of the internet and welcome back to Pudsycraft. I haven't done much since we were last here. I made a couple of tools, so I made an obsidian hatchet. A slime pickaxe, which is really low and it's all they had, so yeah. And a slime broadsword, which will get us by. Basically, I just had a look through here and um, took what I needed, basically, and then left what I didn't need. Um, I don't plan on taking the rest of it except for some of the things with us, so we'll take our book. Um, we might take the signs because they might come in handy. We'll take some string, we'll take the onion seeds. Okay, so I think we're ready to head off. Now, I think you guys might have seen in my inventory that there's these two, there's two villages. Now it says profession three tool station, eight plus eight tool station equal one golden ore berry, eight emeralds equal something one iron sword now i don't know how the gravestone mod works but if we look it up gravestone i wonder if there's something else we need like because there's a lot of different things that we can come across but um chest with bats wow now i'm not really interested in any of this kind of thing i don't I don't know what to do with it yet, so if you guys have any suggestions, that's fine. If not, I'll research it up myself. But what we're going to do, because these poor little men, they ended up passing away before we actually got to the village. I found their um, tombstones. There's actually another one right here. The villager was slain by a zombie, which really is not su surprising at all. But we are going to move these, and we're going to place them down here. Okay, so we're just gonna, uh, let's have a look if there's a better area over the back here. I think under this lovely tree. So put one here. We're just gonna pop him in there. Well, we need to get his, the dirt first. Okay. I think they're the villager trades. Oh, he doesn't want to go in there. I understand that, sir, but you kind of aren't able to control that anymore. Okay, here we go. In you go, sir. Now. There we go. Now, I think that might stop it from being bad now, but I don't know. Okay. Okay. Pop this one in here. And then the final one, so that these guys can rest in peace. Oh, we know he won't go there. He's just gonna pop up, isn't he? There we go, now we'll just put this one on. The other grey stone was found elsewhere, so yes. There we go. Now they can rest under this lovely tree, which we're going to grab some of these, because it's a Yuzi. Is that how you'd say that, I think? Anyway. Now, I, I did a bit of scouting around, as, as you do. And I think we're going to head off from this village, leave these lovely villagers in peace, and head off to a place where we can call our own. So I'm going to quickly run over there now, and I will show you that when we get there. Okay guys, I can see in the distance behind here that there is a seasonal forest. And I think that is going to be the perfect place for our first, like, starting base area. Um... I may go exploring more and find other places, but we are going to maybe start there and see how we go. It's a really nice looking place. Oh, hello little bug. What are you? A small beetle. Um, and we'll see where we go from there. So I'm excited. I like the colours in there. They're very neutral or, well, neutral I guess. They're warm. They're warm colours basically. And I think we're going to clear out a spot and start building our house. So here we are. Now, 
Maybe we should build our house up there. Or I had a more of a vision of building our house along a river. So let's see if there is a river that connects to this temp uh this temperate no it's not a temperate forest it's a seasonal forest i can hear you mr spider grab some of those nope hello mr giant rat you're very cute aren't you why are you attacking me no 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 i don't want to hurt you i didn't no why don't gosh I don't want to be attacking rats. I had pet rats when I was a child. So there's quite a few um, berry bushes around and things like that. There's a beaver? Are you a beaver? Oh, you're attacking me too. Why is everyone so angry? Gosh. I really don't want to be killing the poor little animals. Eat some bread. Hmm. Well, there's a little lake here by the look of it. You know what we could do? As much as it... Well, we could actually probably do it along here anyway. Probably in this area. I think this would be nice, but if I want the lake to happen, I can just maybe dig a bit and have it come further in. There's another beaver. Can we be friends, Mr. Beaver? Ooh, there's an obsidian gravestone? Okay, this could end badly. Let's have a look. Oh, no. And I forgot to right-click it. I keep forgetting to do that. Hmm. Okay. So I think this could work, but let's just quickly have a look through the forest again. And then we should get started on our first build, I think. Or maybe we'll just, I think collecting some more resources would be handy. We might set up a garden. Ah, oh, so there's, is this the same river? Yes, no? I'm very confused now. Don't think so. Hello, Mr. Beaver. Please leave us be. Maybe this isn't a... Oh, we got a bit stuck there. Okay. Maybe this isn't a nice, friendly place. If the beavers own it, maybe they just want to be left in peace. Is that a beaver in there? Or is that a slime? There was a lot of slimes back near that village. See, this looks nice. I think... I think you... Ooh. That's some loud noises, guys. Oh. Gosh, it's dangerous. We come in peace. Okay, I think this could work. Let's have a look from up here. Yes, I think that will work right along there. And then we've got a nice green area here. We'll have our base right in here. I think this is going to be where it is. So we're going to start by collecting some of the wood. And this is dark oak wood. Now, this is a mob that I will kill. Because they're already undead and I'm putting them to rest. Okay. I will eventually, if I have to, I will kill any of the other animals, but I'd rather not. Like, if, if they'd be nice enough to let us be, I wouldn't have to kill them. That would be lovely. Okay, let's just put the chest here and put everything we own in. Okay guys, so I think we can just make a little garden. We did have to fight some bad guys, but we're just going to make a little garden. These aren't the fences I ultimately want, but for now, just to keep our little garden safe. Oh, hello sir. Hi. Okay. Goodbye sir. It was very nice to meet you. Okay. Oh gosh, you're very loud. Little bird. Oh, got another visitor. Oh, hold on. Ah. Okay. Woo. 
going to quickly turn down my um, friendly creature sounds, I think. That would be what that would be, the little birdie. He's just a very loud... Whoa! Whoa, 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 Mr. Creeper. He's running away. Bye! You're coming back now? Okay, please don't blow up. Ooh, okay. Thank you, sir. Now we've got a bit of collateral damage that we'll have to fix up here. As we don't want any of the animals falling in holes around here. Okay, I'm going to need to get some more dirt. Gosh, I wonder if we can fix this tree up a little bit. Nope. Oh, there we go, there's at least something there. Okay, we'll fix that up in a minute. We actually might need it, but that's okay. I wonder if we can float the fence here. We can. Okay. Now, I don't want a very big gut, and I'm not going to close it in or anything. Now, let's grab this dirt here. Take it out a little bit. Now, this is just going to be a berry garden, so... I'm going to just put this one here and this one here. Now we have, I think, all our berry, most of our berry bushes are in here. We've got a hummingbird bush. We don't need that. We don't need that. A winterberry bush. Okay. Um, a strawberry, a yellow elderberry. Uh, we do have another winterberry. And that seems to be it so far. So we just want to do one, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. Now we'll just continue this one over here and then we'll put these ones here. One, two, three, four. And then this one there. So we've got ourselves a little garden. We might just... I guess that'll... the little tufts of leaves can stay here. I think that's part of the... Um, the mod that um, allows us to have the foliage looking all luscious basically. Let's move you over here. So what are you? You put perfectly there. I don't think any of these, they're just plants. So I think that will, you know what? I know that these are tea leaves. So we're going to move the, oh, maybe they weren't. They're, they're a food type though, so that's good. We'll just pop them here. Cassis's saplings? And I think that's what we'll call for this one. This is going to be our new home. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode and I will see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!